All right, guys, so today I'm going to be using the UEI combustible gas leak detector CD200. I'm doing an inspection on a fuel, the fuel system of a generator. These fuel plenums are actually, have a recall on them if they're leaking. So first thing first, I have to do a visual inspection. I don't see anything. I unplug that. You gotta connect the wire to here. Bring it over to my hot terminal on my battery. And this is always so easy. Okay, now I've energized my fuel circuit. Turn it on to alarm. The tip supposedly burns the gas a little bit. That's how it senses it. This is, oh, I think I found the problem. We're gonna bubble it up, but it, right here, it almost looks like the cork is missing. Like it deteriorated. So, this tool found the gas leak. Unplug the battery. We don't need that right now. I can even move the battery out of my way. That's not my way there. Let's see. Problem now. Oh, I was wrong. spray all around but it actually looks like where this where my solenoid where this piece attaches down to the bottom I actually thought it was gonna bubble right here but you can see it's bubbling out down there I'm wondering if I can snug that up what are those eight millimeters So first thing first. Remember it's got a caulk gasket on the Oh that's really loose. I want in the back. I need a longer extension. But that is loose. So, hand it. I love this ratchet. It's sweet, the 84 tooth craftsman ratchet. Something stinks out here all of a sudden. And it wasn't me. I did not fought. I promise. I take full credit when I do.
Make a few turns. Okay. Then I'm also turn. I'm gonna stop right there. Bam, 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 bam. Yep, I lost the sock. Kind of figured. I think what I'm gonna do is put some Loctite on these. Once I verify I can fix, but you can even see this is higher than this. It's only a cork gasket, so I may have to order a new one, but very little pressure. Okay. Just a little. Sniffer. Let's just see, we've got bubbles there. Clear out. This won't work without the gas. doesn't happen again pull those bolts off and put some Loctite on some blue thread lock seal I mean I could crank those tighter but what's the point all right but now while I'm in here let me just the upper I see this hole It's just very deceiving. There's nothing actually going on there. But my leak is fixed. I'm gonna go grab some latte from my truck. If not, there's an advanced auto literally right in that parking lot there. That should have it. Till next time, guys. I'm out.